<laughs> and why? Why is everything so damn stupid? You know what? This world, everything in it, I get so tired of it. With all this nonsense that I've had to deal with. What does it matter? And all these pretenses, these labels that they like to put on me. When I'm sick of it, I'm sick of being a chain dog. So you know what I did? I did the only thing I knew. And I took out my chains. Don't worry. You'll understand. Or you won't. And I'll trounce over you too. I find it kind of funny. After I started taking the chains off. After I went too far once. Nothing ever hurt me quite so much. But now anything with it. You know they hype up killing. They act like it's the worst thing in the world. Tell me, what would you do to someone who defiles your most important person? Go ahead. Tell me how wrong I was. Tell me how I should have trusted my friends when they stabbed me in the back. No. I've got no love for people who stabbed me in the back and laugh while they're doing it. I was gullible. And I can't survive that way. So now they're dead. So what? What does it matter to you? Now you're just another victim, aren't you? Or are you gonna try and be a hero? Stop me. Go ahead. You can try. You can't be serious. You actually think you can get through to me? You think I'm the person I used to be, don't you? How pathetic. You really think that that weak old me would come back from the dead? You think that pathetic loser has any place in this world? You're worse than a dumbass. You're a corpse. As far as I'm concerned. Now, while well, I'm still feeling generous, do you want to leave me alone? Or are you going to persist and get in more trouble? I'm already going to get you. Now the only question is, how's this going to end for you? Because I don't see any good ending. Not with you being condescending, acting like you know me. So what? You think you do. What's to tell you? And I won't kill you right here and now. What's the matter? You lost your nerve now that you're up against the wall? You didn't think I would do it, did you? A lot of people changed. And let me tell you, this world isn't very forgiving. Why don't I teach you a lesson? About what happens when you mess with a convicted villain. I gave you your chance, and now it's over. Regret it, but nothing will change. And I'll show you what I faced, and have a little fun while I'm at it. You don't want me. You don't want me to be good either. You just think I'm this person I used to be. What does it matter to you? Are you just some kind of fan? Why would you be? After everything. I just... You don't understand anything. What if I were to do this? Huh? <clears throat> Does it mean anything? Does it really? My... My love. They... They did the same thing with me. And it was all for nothing. 
No for them to leave. Without saying a damn thing. No, I was never like this. Until after everything went to hell. I'm not the same person after that. Nobody is. Once you lose yourself, it's never the same. You just... You keep going on. But you don't know why. Damn it! Why am I even telling you this? You don't know a damn thing. Not at all. I've killed people. What don't you understand? I'm no hero. I never will be again. You and all the other fans of me think you understand it. But you don't know a damn thing about me. So why try and expect me to give a damn what you think? Pissing me off like this. Why would I care? Any of that doesn't matter. Don't tell me you're gonna cling like a puppy dog now. Nauseating. Damn you. Making it out like this. Why do I have to deal with you? In the first place. Look, fine. If you want my time. You're gonna have to show me something. Look, I don't care if you're a hero or a villain. That doesn't matter. I don't want you to be like me. I want you to be away from here, honestly. I'm not interested in what you're trying to do. And if you're gonna stick around, you better at least be somewhat entertaining. Damn dumbass. And I'll show you what it means to be around me. It's nothing good. You damn idiot. Why don't you understand? Why can't you see it? Fine. Learn the hard way. Come with me. This way, dumbass. Ah, Bakugo. Looks like you've got fresh meat, huh? Looks delicious. Why don't we share? Not right now, Shigaraki. Not right now. Oh, someone's touchy, aren't you? That's okay. I wouldn't poach from my buddy. Oh, who am I kidding? You're just a stuck-up idiot who thinks you can be here, aren't you? Go ahead, keep riding the line. Tell yourself you're not what you are. A monster. What about those innocent people that you accidentally killed? Shut up. I don't want to hear it anymore. I get it. So just put an end to this. Shut up already. Damn dumbass. All of them. All of you. Now do you see? I work with Shigaraki now. Now leave me while you still have a chance. Now, now. We wouldn't want your nice little friend telling all about the society. It'd be too sad, wouldn't it? Now that UA is gone. Shut up. I don't give a damn about the past. Those friends of mine were worse than you guys ever have been. I'll give you guys that much. You didn't stab a knife in my back yet. Oh, and it's so much more convenient. Now we get an ally that's a rabid dog. Not just a normal one. That's what I'd call efficiency. Now we can take on the last boss. The little bit of survivors. The ones who still stand against the League of Villains. 
Whatever. I'll deal with that when we do our damn operation. Fine, fine. But what are you going to do about that loose end? We can't have them talking now. I'll deal with them, okay? Thank you, promise. You wouldn't want me to hold your hand after that, would you? It'd be a big loss to both of us, and you know I don't hate my comrades. I want the best for you. That's why I'm saying, you either get them to join, or you put them out of their misery. You can do it however you want, quick and painless, slow and torturous. I don't judge. <laughs> I'll do it! I'll deal with this now. Come on! This way, dumbass! What do you think you're doing? Look at what you did! Now you're involved. Now I can't just get you out of this, damn it! If I could, I would have. If you insisted on it. How am I gonna fix this? No, how are you gonna fix this? I can't just magically whisk the problems away, you know? I don't have that kind of quirk. It's all over. Look, now you only have one choice, okay? You have to be part of this motley group if you want to survive. Look, I don't care. What you came from. Am I gonna have to knock some sense into you? I'm doing this to protect you. Look. I don't want to have to hurt you. But I will if that's what it takes. Just shut up and listen to me. Listen to me or you're dead meat. Got it? Damn it. Wouldn't have happened this way if you just listened at the damn start. What kind of a dumbass lie is that? You a villain? Don't think so. No way in hell. You're not fooling me. Tch. Dumbass. You really think that I... Hey, what are you doing? What the hell? I didn't want to have to do this. But I think I'm going to have to put you out. Look. You're giving me this much trouble already. How am I supposed to do this? There's things that need to be done. The world's a fucked up place. And this is the only way. If you want to live, you're going to have to be my concubine. You're going to have to serve me. It's the only way. That or you be useful to the organization. You think you got the heart to kill people? I didn't. But I lost that heart a long time ago. And I don't plan on getting it back. It made me weak. And part of me loves the beast inside. So. What's gonna be? Death? Or being my plaything? Damn it. You're making this too easy. I was hoping you might choose death. Not because I want to kill you. But because... You just... You don't understand what you're getting involved with. You keep this up. And you'll end up worse than me. Damn you. You don't even understand. There's so many things that... Why do I even try? It's already too damn late anyways. So... Now that you're my concubine... You're gonna be living under this roof. You're not gonna leave, 
without me. Or else the entirety of the League of Villains is going to be after you. And they'll be after me too. Hey. You know I warned you, right? Then... Damn it, this is your fault. If I wasn't... If I didn't have those memories... Of the better times... I'd blow you up right now... For your own sake. There's someone I used to know... Who would be pissed at me if I did that. So I won't. Look... I've already been too nice to you already. There's too much that's at stake. And if anyone were to see, or hear what we're talking about, then... If anyone were to hear, eh? <clears throat> Damn it. Look at what you made me do. How much did you hear, Shigaraki? Enough to know, you've just volunteered yourself for my newest experiment. What the hell? Then what says I'm going to be up for it? I don't have to do that. Oh, that's where you're wrong, because I don't think you're a very loyal dog anymore. Now, now, Bakugo, I'm going to have to make you... Just a tad bit more... Agreeable. I never agreed to that, Shigaraki. What do you think you're doing? Hey, get your hands off me. I don't want to blow you up, but I will. Oh, silly. You can't blow up those Nomus. They're explosion resistant. Uh, what the hell? That's... No way. And for your little lover here. You're going to come with us too. You're part of the experiment. Don't you feel so lucky? Hey, don't involve them. There's no reason for them. They're just some kind of groupie that doesn't know what they're getting into. Oh, we can't leave loose ends. Now, why don't you come nicely, and I won't kill you where you stand. Now come one, come all, back to a happy family reunion in Shigaraki's lab. I'm sure you'll enjoy it if you survive. Come along now, we wouldn't want to be late. Why don't you leave the charge? Leave them out of it. Come on, damn it! You wanted something with me. Oh, you're such a delightful broken record. Don't you realize? There's no escape anymore. It's all over. You've been caught. You're through. At least until I fix a few mistakes. I'm just like a developer, fixing all the bugs. Except these bugs are those pesky beliefs of yours. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got something good for you. Something that'll shut you right up. Look. Again. They don't know anything. Oh, as much as I'd like to trust you and trying that co-op level, I'm thinking that, well... That might mean a possible game over for us. And I don't have time for game overs. You understand. It's just business. Nothing too personal. Plus, I'm not even hurting anyone. Well, much. If it's a critical hit, I'll apologize. Damn it, Shigaraki. Let us go. No, no. Begging isn't going to help you. That's because I don't feel like it. 
You know, I don't need an amazing reason. It's just, well, I do things as I see fit. I gotta take care of the organization. You know, I, I'm just business dad, doing business things. And I need to take care of everyone who wants things to go bad. Now, I'm not accusing you, but you're too soft, Bakugo. I thought you were a monster. When you killed those people, I had hopes for you. But it turns out, you need a little push in the right direction. As for your little concubine, we'll see how you view them once you're through surgery. Maybe I'll test something on them too. It sounds like fun, doesn't it? Being a test subject for pioneering new medicine. Doesn't it feel noble? Doesn't it feel great? I'm practically getting so excited. And just to do you both justice, why don't I keep you in the same room? That way, you can reflect on it as the changes happen. Of course, you'll be strapped down to an operating table, but you'll still be able to look at each other, maybe talk, provided you both still can. <laughs> Damn you, Shigaraki! Why do you always have to do this? Haven't I been useful enough? Oh, it's never been about use. I'm just doing something that was a long time coming. You see, you were never really a exemplary villain. You were chaotic. You killed people. But that doesn't make you a true villain. Villains need more. That... Certain quality, that certain... Ah, who am I kidding? I just felt like picking on you a little. Consider it just a friendly jab. And a reminder of where you stand. What the hell? I... Damn it. So what are you gonna do? Huh? Gonna kill me? Waste all my talents? No, you know me better than that. I wouldn't dream of killing someone so fantastically interesting. No, I want to see you in a different light. Why don't you show me just how villainous you can be? What makes you think I'm going to do that? Oh, <laughs> Poor Bakugo. You don't realize it yet. You won't have a choice either. Damn you, Shigaraki! Damn you! Now you two lovebirds, just sit tight. I'll take care of all the difficult things. Like your medicine. I'm sure you're curious what it is. Aren't you dying to know? Just get it over with. Do your damn worst. <laughs> you don't want my worst. You certainly don't want that. Oh yeah, you think I'm scared? Go ahead and try me. Are you inviting disaster? Why, that's delightfully chaotic of you. But oh, so stupid. You don't actually think you can take me. <laughs> You're such a naive fool. It's endearing if it wasn't so basic. Now, aren't you curious? There's so much that you're going to have to deal with. It's gonna be so much fun. Is that what you think? Damn idiot. Oh, what does insulting me do? Absolutely nothing. Now, why don't we be civil for a moment and realize this isn't just about you? No, I wouldn't dedicate all this effort for just anyone. No, you're special. You're a special kind of idiot. Now, where was I? Oh, all right. Now, before we get started, 
There's just one thing. Oh wait, I won't spoil the surprise. So now, why don't you and your little lovebird have some nice last moments? I promise I won't peek too much. Damn it! I gotta get this off. I don't have much time. It's all your fault. No. It's what I'd like to say, but it's mine. Look. I'm sorry for dragging you in this. No matter what happens, I'll try and think of something. That's the best I got right now. Let's try and blow these off. What? My quirk's not working. Nothing's coming out. That's not normal. What the hell? You didn't actually think I'd let you blow the place up. You might kill someone. So instead, I thought I'd fit the room with a very special new toy. You're probably thinking it's something having to do with quirk inhibiting, but in essence, it's not. You could use your quirk, but you don't want to. The hell's that supposed to mean? Of course I want to use it. No, you don't know what you want. You're already caught in the spider's web. You already tried to take on a boss at least 25 levels higher than you. And unfortunately, I don't think there's a way you can avoid a game over. At least not for those pesky morals of yours. Do you smell it? Perhaps you do. Perhaps you don't. It's a brand new experimental drug. Now, what it does varies by person but it seems that you your softness is working against you I can't tell from here but if I had to make a guess you're afraid you'll hurt someone you don't make any sense like hell I am just watch me damn it what the hell did you do Damn it. Now that he's talking about it, how does your head feel? This isn't good. We gotta get out of here quick. There's no telling what concoctions Shigaraki's worked up. Oh, that's quite an uphill battle. But why don't you just watch? I'm sure you'll see firsthand. Look! Cut it out, Shigaraki. What do you want? <laughs> what a magnificent sight! Seeing Katsuki Bakugo on his knees, begging like a dog. Why don't you bark for me, boy? Show me how pathetic you can be. You gotta promise. Not humiliating myself for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> There's gotta be some way you can prove it. Oh, you don't get to make that decision. Why don't you believe me? I'm sure, well, nothing too bad will happen. <laughs> I'll kill you, you damn asshole. This isn't fair. Oh, life isn't fair, buddy. Don't you realize it? Once you got involved with me, your life was in my hands from the very start. Don't you just love it? You, I don't know what's happening in my head. Just be careful. I'm sure it's something else for you, but whatever happens, we'll make it through this. Oh, how touching. Lovers clinging close on the eve of their demise. It's so poetic, isn't it? 
like Shakespeare. I love myself a good tragedy. In fact, hold that thought. I just thought of an even better one. I'll be right there. As I was saying, why don't we step things up a bit? Now that the agent has taken hold, I can do something even better. You see this little tiny pinprick of a needle will allow you to be more honest with yourself. I've always been curious. What would win? Your rage, your hatred, or maybe something more noble? What do you think, Kotsky? Still confident in yourself? Why don't we put you to the ultimate test? I'll give you 20 minutes if you can survive, then you two are free to go. What the hell kind of deal is that? What the hell's in the syringe? Oh, that's the beauty of it. You don't get to know. Sorry, buddy. This is the mystery level. Let's let RNG decide your fate, shall we? If you agree, of course. It's a bet. What the hell? Why wouldn't I take it? Oh, there's a myriad of reasons. Like if your defense or willpower is low enough, well, you don't want to know what happens. Then again, you might just end up a monster. Like me. I'll never be like you. Doesn't matter what you do to me, dumbass. You better realize who you're dealing with. I'm better than all the rest. No one can take me down and I... What the hell? Oh, sorry. I didn't give you a chance to answer, did I? I guess the bet is on. You just pissed me off a little, so I thought I'd give you... Just a teensy-weensy taste of what's gonna happen. Damn it! What do you think you're doing, Shake Rocky? Taking off my restraints? Do you got a death wish? No, not at all. You couldn't harm me even if you tried. Wanna bet? Take this! Uh, what's going on? I can barely move. Uh, uh, what'd you do to me? No, it's not what I did to you. It's what you did to you. Seems like you're a guilty one, aren't you? This'll be fun. Uh, uh, get out of my head! No! It's not my fault. No, but it is. I know what you did, and so do you. Also, you... You seem remarkably sensible considering you faced my new drug. Seems like it's not all that effective yet. Good to know. But I have a place for you to play, too. I'm gonna close the door, and you two are going to be my experiment. What's gonna happen is simple. If you two can last 20 minutes without killing each other, then there we go. Like I said, you'll be free. That's... Yes. Oh, look at the poor fella. He's all caught up in his delusions. Caught up in that lovely past of his. Now, 
What do you think he's facing? I mean, you could always wonder firsthand if you want, but nah. I want to study him. Sorry to say, but you're kind of a trash mob. So, I'll leave it to the two of you. Don't have too much fun now. Otherwise, you might just break a leg. I wouldn't want you to go and get yourself ganked to the point where, well, there's no turning back. That'd be too sad, wouldn't it? And I'm not heartless. Once Bakugo faces his demons, maybe he'll be just a bit more trustworthy. As right now, I can't really trust him. He's too much like he used to be. And he turned me down once. <laughs> Stay back! <laughs> I don't know. All I can say is I wanna. Uh, there's so much that I. This rage and. It makes me wanna tear you to pieces, but. It's so difficult. Like. I'm no longer me. Slowly having it stripped away. Stay back. Or else I might not be able to... Doesn't matter what's wrong. Just... Get away from me! Uh, 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 you don't have much... Much of a chance, do you? Do it! I'll show you. You're mocking me, aren't you? Show you what happens to people who take me lightly. Not in the right state of mind. Oh, I'm just fine. I'm clear as day. I just know from the moment I've met you, you've caused so many problems. Now I'm gonna get a little revenge on you. No regrets. Don't hate me for this, but I need it. I need you. Give me your everything. It's not me. It's not me, but it is. There's a monster inside. And I'm gonna take everything that I want. You're all mine now. Now just be a good little pet and show me how deplorable you can be. I want to see you in your rawest form. I want to see you cry out my name because I don't have anything else that interests me. Do you want to blame anything? Blame your fate. I've got plenty. Plenty of things. That point to your demise. What am I saying? I... Ugh. You're mine. My little plaything. You're happy yet, Shigaraki?
Listen, I need you to trust me. Otherwise, we're both dead, mate. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to hold back these hellish feelings, but. Uh, 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 I need you to trust me. I'm gonna devour you. Got it. I'll make you cry out my name. <clears throat> That's right. I'm your master now. And if you want any hope of surviving, then you're going to give me everything. Forgive me. I can't hold back. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's see how much you can handle before you break. Come on, set the best you've got. Well, I'll just have to devour you, whether you like it or not. Yeah, that's right. You can't stop me even if you wanted to. It's not like have a choice. Look. I'm sorry. This may be unforgivable, but I can't hold back the monster. He did something messed with my head, and I I'm trying. But there's only so much I could do. There's too much rage, too much desire, and I... <sighs> now I feel oddly calm. Now you're my prey. And awfully sensitive, aren't you? Is that your weak spot? Hero. Or should I say former hero? You're just like me. A monster 
waiting to be awoken. Oh, mine. Do you like it? Me manhandling you? Without you saying, I already know you do. Go ahead and tell me I'm wrong. You're looking down at you. You're damn irresistible, and it pisses me off. I don't want Shigaraki to win, but I also know I'm a monster too. So I don't think there's any avoiding it. You best prepare yourself, because I'm not backing down anymore. You feel that? Do you like it just like that? Good. Let me hear you cry out. Go ahead. Show me what you want to show me. And I'll do exactly what I want. You got that? <sighs> Do you like me rubbing up against you? Just like that. Why don't you relax? Or else it might hurt. I'll show you the monster I've become. There's no excuses. Not anymore. I'm not going to let you off easy. I hope you don't expect it to be. No. Not today. Not now. I owe you too much. And I'm not backing down on that. Uh, yeah. Yeah, show me what you've got. Uh, 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 And what if I stopped right here? What would you think? I bet you'd beg me to keep going. 
I want to hear it. Show me how desperate you are for me to continue. Come on! You can show me, can't you? Do it for me! You know it's what we deserve, right? I'm sure you've been affected too. So why don't you show me how deplorable how much you can fall, just like me. <sighs> What's the matter? You look like you're wavering. Good. That's what I wanted to hear. <sighs> yeah, yeah, you like that. <sighs> And what if I bite you right in your weak spot? Can't hold back. You better enjoy this. This is addictive, don't you think? You can't resist me. Just like I can't resist you. So come on. Show me how much of a deplorable fallen hero you are. You're not gonna see the other Bakugo. Cause he doesn't exist. <laughs> you didn't actually think that this is the end. Did you? You're such a damn dumbass. No. I'm gonna have fun with you. For a long, long, slowly drawn out time. Until you're a monster. Just like me. <sighs> So you got your show, Shigaraki. Now let me out. Oh, you're jumping the gun again. You don't think I'd trust you right away, did you? Now I know you're more agreeable than before, but I think this might be just the start. Why don't we see how much we can mess up that brain of yours? Or maybe I'll test it on them. Where's the fun in that? I don't want them involved. Because I'm having too much fun with them already. Though I guess a little experimentation could go a long way. <laughs> Sorry. Guess I lost my cool. Oh, that's just fine. It's not losing your cool when it's wanted. You're quite the interesting one. Maybe I'll trust you a little. You'll see a compartment in the room. Open it. It's a little drop box. What's inside is a little gift to you. Oh yeah? What the hell is it? Don't be impatient. Go check it out for yourself. What the hell? You're trying to leash me? Damn, Tomura. Well, I can't exactly go trusting you. You haven't proven you're a loyal puppy yet. You may have survived, and I may have promised 
If you lasted 20 minutes without killing each other, you could be free. But I'm thinking you want more than that. Go on. So you're making me wear a collar. I assume there's a bomb or something. Keep me in line. You think I'm just your hound dog? No, I wouldn't dream of it. Honestly, you're more of a... pet that I like that's endearing. I mean, if not for that cutie over there, I'd probably join you. I'll take you on any day. Don't get all up in a tissy fit. It would ruin your stats, and you want this level up to count. So, you put it on, and both of you can go free. You and your new pet, and me and my new pet. See how the chain of command goes? Isn't it a beautiful thing? Damn you. I can't really do anything here, can I? No, not really. Not like you can escape. Oh, yeah. And about your power. Your quirk is more or less... different. You're still an explosive boy. But... With your nice new collar, I'll be able to tell you when you can or cannot. Bear those fangs. Oh, and before I forget, there's someone else who wanted to meet you. Kachan. Kachan, I... I came to rescue you. But then... I got caught and... Put a can in it. You damn deco! You're gonna get in my way too? No, I just wanted to help, and then I made a mess of things. Let's say we get out of here, and we could take down Shigaraki, and... Look at where you're talking from. You really think you can stop him? You're more deluded than anyone. More deluded than he is. I'm not even the Kachan you remember, damn it! I'm a villain now. And if I need to show you, I'll do it firsthand. Tomura! Where is he? Well, show me you're loyal and maybe I'll tell you. Maybe. Fine. It's on there. Where is he? All right. Follow this hallway. Oh, and take your little toy. Come on. We gotta get going. You two have a nice one. I promise I won't be watching anymore. So just enjoy yourselves. Yeah. This is gonna be interesting. Kachan? Why are you... Did you escape? Why are you looking at me like that? Why else, dumbass? Because I... I think you're so damn pathetic! Huh? But why, Kachan? I don't understand you. What do you mean? You're toy number two. Now, get a move on. Actually, Tomur, I know you're still watching. Why don't you take care of things? Oh, did you catch me that easy? What do you need? 
Another one of those syringes. Oh, threatening with the drugs. It'll make it more agreeable, won't it? That depends on your definition. We'll have to see what happens. Good. Kachan, you're scaring me. What does it all mean? I... Shut up, you damn Deku! You're my plaything now. Just like this one. What did you do to them? What's with that expression? Are you okay? What the hell's going on here, Kachan? I... Just shut up, Deku. I'll show you what's going on. Got it. No, I don't. Not at all. I. Uh, uh, hmm. uh, uh, I had to do something to shut you up. Now, I think it's time we all got something more interesting. Like relating each other. Sharing the pain. <laughs>